what up guys it's Steph welcome back to my channel today I'm filming um, the washi tag and I found a couple of different versions of this um, online so I just combined the most common questions um, into a 10 question um, tag you just have to excuse everything sort of behind it I'm just filming this in front of my nail polish um, storage because because I've clearly got so much washi and it's the easiest place to do it um so I will I can't remember off the top of my head the um, name of the person who originated the washi tag I'll put it on the screen um, just here um so all credit does go to her but I have added a couple questions that I've seen other people add or that I've seen in different variations so yes let's just jump straight in Question one is show us your washi tape collection. This is pretty much it. I'm gonna go through and like show you everything just in a sped up in the for in the moment in a moment. <laughs> um, but I have this old perfume box here, which is full. These super old school drawers like that I used for school, so hence the labels and these trays that I just got from a two dollar shop. Um, so I'm going to take you down and show you in each section individually. Okay, question two is, what are your ultimate favourite washi or washies of all time? Um, in all honesty, I'd probably just have to say my glitters, because I've got so many of them. This entire container is just glitter washi, and then in this one, I have some overflow glitter washi just here and here. And then in this one, I have my glitter skinny tapes just here and then more overflow glitter washi here. Silver would probably be my favourite though, um, my silver glitters because I've got so much silver and a lot of them do contain silver as well. So they would probably be my favourites, I'd say. What are your most recent... Uh, question three. Question three is what are your most recent favourite washies? Um, most recent, so that would be like ones I've bought recently. I'd say probably these skinny tapes here. I haven't used any of them yet, but they're like neon colors, which is really fun. And also these thin ones here, because this is the first like bold set that I've got. Let's just fix you up. Um, they're like bolder colors and I really like those. And these ones, um, as well are probably my most recent favourite and I bought those at the Brisbane Planner Markets. I will link the haul um, above. What are your least favourite washi? This for me is easy. 
all the ones in this drawer, this drawer, and these back ones here are my least favourite. And probably these ones from Scotch. Um, this, these two drawers and these ones are all from Spotlight. And I just find them too basic and repetitive. And then these ones are like the Scotch like sellotape kind of ones. Um, they're like a plastic rather than like an actual tape and they just rip super easy like like look at that i can't even peel it up now but like you know they just rip in pieces um and then in addition to those also this is full of plastic washi as well down here um and i love them but at the same time it's like sticky tape and i just don't see the point so yeah probably those Question five, what are the most expensive washi tapes you own or the most you have paid? Um, okay, well, let's just come back down here. So these six here are Jonathan Adler washi tapes and there's, I think, 10 meters per roll and they were like $20 for a set of three. They're probably my most expensive that I've paid for because I bought them at the same time. So 40 bucks straight up. These ones here though um, are Michael's tapes and I didn't buy them. I was gifted them. But when you change the price into Australian dollars, they're actually probably the most expensive. Um... Yeah, but I'd probably say I'd go with my Jonathan Adler tapes just here. How do you, uh, question six, how do you store your washi? Like this, so this drawer tower, these trays and this, but I do want to get um, one of those like rolling caddies. If you've seen my makeup collection video, I'll chuck a card above as well. If you've seen that video, then you'll know what I'm talking about, but I want to get one of those carts similar to that one, but with the 10 thin drawers instead of the four thicker ones um, to store my washing in. I just think that would be a fun idea and it would be functional for me because those um, actually fit underneath my desk. So yeah, I wouldn't mind um, getting one of those, but they're kind of, they're pricey for what they are. So I'm not totally sold on it just yet. Question seven, favorite project using washi? Um, huh. Probably a planner spread, I would say. I mean, I use washi quite a lot, um, but probably a planner spread. Let me grab my planner. So I've grabbed my old Erin Condren. I use a lot of washi in my monthly views and stuff. So my July monthly is actually probably my favorite. I did use some stickers as well, as you can see, but it's mostly washi. And I did it to still stick with the red and navy for the like American colors, but I chucked in a bit of pink and some silver and I think it really just softened it. So yeah, I'd probably say this one is my favorite. Um, I did like my August as well though, but yeah, no, definitely my July is my favorite project. Question eight, how many tapes do you have? Uh, well, looking at all of this, like <laughs> too many. I've got around about the 900 mark, around 900 tapes. Uh, question nine, where do you buy your washi? Everywhere that sells it. So I've bought washi from Spotlight, Lincraft, Officeworks, Kmart, Big W, Target, um, $2 shops, random craft shops, online, so Washi Tape Australia, uh, Washi Lane, Rabbit in the Dark, Oh Hello, um, I've been gifted some, I bought some off eBay, some off Amazon, some off AliExpress, I have Washi from Typo, um, Yeah, Kiki K, everywhere. Erin Condren, I've got washi from everywhere. Uh, Reject shop, <laughs> like you name it, a shop in Australia that sells washi, I've probably already got it. And question 10, 
a tape you have bought but never used. A lot of them actually. Um, actually, I I know which one I want to show. Which tray is it in? So I got this tape from a Washi Lane subscription. So yes, I did buy it. This deer tape. I did show this in a haul. I will link that haul as well for you guys. And it is breathtakingly beautiful. But because it's so beautiful, I don't want to use it. I'm scared to use it. I've never used it. I don't know if I ever will. I think it's going to be like a guilty pleasure washi. Um, that would be a fun question, actually. Guilty pleasure washi. But, yeah, this one. I've I paid for it and just have never used it. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what kind of washi tape you like. Do you like glitter? Do you like paper tape, plastic tape, thick, thin, whatever you like. Just comment me something about washi because I'm obsessed with it. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see how I use all of this washi. And if you have any video requests on um, things I can do with washi to show you guys, like maybe some washi tape DIYs or something, if you have any requests like that or something you want to see, leave me a comment down below and let me know because I'd love to do some stuff like that for you. Don't forget to open that description box to find my friends and all my social media links. Be sure to follow me. I love to connect with you guys and I'll catch you in my next one. Bye.